the museum's final gallery, the Operations Room, which was once a lavish ballroom, hangs a day in the back of brick by Roy Knockhold. This is a large painting which fits into this palatial room. The painting was commissioned in 1954 with the specific intention of it being hung at headquarters fighter command, where it was first displayed on the 12th of April, 1955. The painting depicts an aerial attack on London, with German bombers being intercepted by hurricanes and spitfires. Although there isn't a specific date attributed to this battle, the scene is iconic of battles fought during the Battle of Britain period. The German bombers are approaching London from the east and are passing over the Isle of Sheppey. The aircraft leading the attack are Dornier 172s flying at about 12,000 feet, followed by Heinkel 111 aircraft, and in the background are Junkers 88s. High above the main mass of aircraft, the German top cover of Messerschmitt 109s is making vapour trails. Converging vapour trails approaching from the southeast indicate that the Messerschmitts are about to be attacked by high flying Spitfires. Knockholz was a self taught motoring artist who served with the RAF during the Second World War. He became an official war artist and carried out commissions for the Ministry of Information. <laughs> 